Progress has been a really great opportunity to learn all about accelerators and accelerator physics in a condensed amount of time. I think the biggest takeaway for me is that I'm at the beginning of my PhD and it's really great to learn about these fundamentals so early on, uh, as well as all the visits that we have with being able to visit CERN and PSI and lots of other places. I don't think there's many schools or places that you can get this opportunity. So the lecturers have been very, very knowledgeable. Um, we've been taught a lot of different subjects, so you can tell just even by their accents, all the different kind of backgrounds and knowledge that they have. We've learned all about theoretical physics as well as the practicalities, so it's been great. They've been able to tell us bits and pieces from their own experiences on the job as well. For me, as my work uh, here at CERN as an accelerator operator, to do the GWAS was an opportunity to understand better the machine I work on, to understand some of the theoretical principles which uh, underpin the operation of the, of the machine. And uh, as a result of this, uh, I feel more confident uh, with the machine, and this will help me to, to improve my work and uh, to improve the optimization of the machine during operations. To work alongside masters and PhD students was, uh, was cool, it was a fun opportunity and uh, it was nice to exchange ideas and uh, experiences because we all have uh, different experiences in life and work. This was demonstrated during the project workshop when we, uh, we worked collaboratively uh, to exchange experience and ideas in order to, to complete the project and it's really this uh, collaborative approach which we see here at CERN every day. Well, I wanted to deepen my law knowledge in accelerator physics. I actually didn't expect having fun, but it ended up pretty nice anyway. <laughs> there was people from Australia, from India, from Pakistan, from Iran. It was kind of funny. You learn a lot of body language. <laughs>